What's up guys, Dynamic Meme here. Today I will be showing you how to set a static IP address to one of your devices within PFSense. What you're going to want to do is go to your PFSense dashboard here, click on Status, DHCP Leases. Now we are looking at the device that you want to assign a static IP to. For example, my Pixel 4 XL phone is currently assigned to 11.0.0.16. We don't want that. We want it to be assigned to a number that we can always reach it. So we will click on this arrow here, sorry, this plus sign here that says add static mapping. Now keep in mind, you have to put this outside of your DHCP pool. So currently our wireless LAN DHCP pool is 11.0.0.10 to 11.0.0.245, which is almost the entire range that we can use. But we do have some free addresses, so we can set this to 11.0.0.9. And we'll just call this pixel 4 XL. And description, my pixel phone. Okay, and then we can leave all this whatever, unless you need to change any of it, hit save, and then apply. And now, next time that my phone tries to connect to the network, it should assign itself 11.0.0.9. And I will take a screenshot on my phone to verify that that's what happened. Okay, disconnect. Connect. And there it is. Now, you might want to set an alias for it. This may come useful in the future if you want to do more things like port forwarding and whatnot. I doubt this would be useful on a phone, but for a computer, for say, you may want to run a server, a game server and you're gonna to wanna to port forward. So, for example, we'll just call this Pixel Phone. And the IP will be the static IP that we gave it, 11.0.0.9, and we'll save it. Now to have the alias, whenever you do anything within PFSense, all you'll have to do is type in Pixel Phone, and it'll go to 11.0.0.9 for you. All right, I hope this helped you, and we'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye-bye.